welcome back to my channel my name is Brittany for those of you who are new to my channel so on today's video I'm going to show you how to do this soft glam makeup look this look has recently been one of my favorite looks to do it is so easy and quick to do it looks so good also like do you see my skin I hope you guys enjoy this video so don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on that post notification so you don't miss a video and without further ado, let's get on with today's video. Okay, so I have already went in with my moisturizer to prep my skin. I went in with my Believe moisturizer. I did my eyebrows off camera just to save some time. So now that my hair is pulled back, I'm going to go in with my primer. I'm going to go in with the YSL Blur Primer. So for foundation, I feel like I'm so late to this foundation. I feel like I'm the only one in the world who hasn't tried this foundation. But I decided to get my hands on it and it's the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation. I picked up Fair Ivory as my shade. And the way I'm going to apply it is with a brush. So I'm just going to put it in the back of my hand. Okay, that's a lot. And I'm just going to get some of my finger and dot it in my face. My neck, don't forget your neck, and I'm just gonna blend it out. So, I tried this foundation a couple days ago, and I loved the finish it gave to my skin. It made my pores look like there wasn't any, and I was impressed. Also, my skin isn't doing it's not doing the best, but it's doing better. I also did get a facial a couple days ago. I got a dermaplaning facial and I feel like that helped my skin a lot. And basically that facial is just, it removes the little hairs from your skin. And I loved it. Okay, so for my concealer, I'm going to go in with my ColourPop Pretty Fresh Concealer. I recently purchased this one also. <laughs> I purchased so many things, but um, it's a little bit light. But don't worry, we're gonna fix it. Like, I look like a ghost right now, but I look like a friendly ghost by the end of this. So, I've been doing something new with my concealer, and I haven't been placing as much as I do other times. And so, what I do is I place some on the side of my nose, then I place some on the bottom of my eyes. Just like that, and then I'm gonna place some on the side of my nose, just like that, and then I'm gonna do a line on this right here, just so my eyes look more long. I'm gonna put some on the arch of my nose, and then some on my forehead. So I'm not placing too much on my forehead, just a tiny bit, and then some on my chin. So now I'm just gonna blend it out. Just like that, like, do you see the difference? Well, I look, mm. I'm starting to look like myself. Okay, so moving on to powder. I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me powder. I love this powder, oh my god. I cannot live without this powder. You guys need to let me know a new powder because I've been using this powder for so long. I think I need a new one. But I'm just gonna blend out the lines, so. I apply this powder there's no one and this concealer I love I recently tried it out a couple days ago and it did not crease whatsoever on me and usually it creases so much but this one it did not crease whatsoever and I actually loved it so I'm gonna get a brush I'm gonna put some on the back I mean I'm gonna put some on my brush and then I'm just gonna lay some on my eyes it's like my favorite trick to do so apply the powder the powder with a brush. Alright, so now that I have applied my powder, I'm going to take my beauty blender and bake. So I'm going to take the same powder but in a different shade and I'm going to place it on the outer parts of my face just to bring a little bit more darkness into the skin. It's a little bit light. I hadn't filmed in forever. It felt like I hadn't filmed in like months, but it's been like a month since I last posted. And 
I have a friend that texted me and was like, when are you posting? I'm waiting. I've been waiting. And he's a guy and I'm like, oh my god. And I started laughing because I'm like, what the heck? It was so funny. Now I'm going to go in with my bronzer. I recently purchased this bronzer because I had been using my bronzer for so long. And I felt like I needed a new bronzer. So I bought, I bought the BH Brilliance Bronzer in Golden Gal. And I really like the bronzer. It's really, really good. Um, it bronzes the skin really nicely, but not too much, which is what I like. So I'm just going to place it on my cheeks. Is it, do you see that? It's like not like too muddy. It's like the perfect color for me, which I really like. It's really nice. Oh my god, it just like sculpts. It just sculpts. Is that how you say it? Sculpts? Sculp that sounds so weird. Sculpts. <laughs> Ew. It just like, you know, defines the cheekbones very nicely. And I like that. Can you like see the difference? It like bronzes up the skin so nicely. Oh my god. Like, I found my new favorite bronzer. I don't know why, but I am always filming so late at night. It's 10. And I was supposed to film so early. I was like, hmm, okay, I'm going to shower. I'm going to do my nails. And I was like, I'm going to film around like 1 or 2. And it's 10 o'clock at night. Oh my god. I need to do better with like my filming schedule because I'd be filming really really late all the time. I remember my first video I filmed at like 4 in the morning. I finished at 4 in the morning and I was like, oh my god, like never again. And uh -uh. Okay, so for blush, I don't have a favorite blush at the moment, but I do like the Milani Luminoso blush. It's such a good blush. It it's like the perfect pink and like perfect shimmer towards it. So I like to bring it up very high. It makes my cheekbones, makes them stand out a little bit more, which I like that. It's okay if you go a little bit heavy handed. You can also go in with like the same sponge you went in with and blend it out. Do you see that? Okay, so I'm gonna go and cut my jawline real quick. I'm gonna move on to my eyes. So I'm going to take my beauty blender, still have foundation on the back of my hand, and I'm going to take some and put it onto my eyes and blend it into it. So for the eyes, I'm going to take a big fluffy brush. This is the Morphe M531 brush, and I'm going to get my bronzer, the one that I used on my skin. I'm going to do windshield wiper motions. When it comes to my soft glam look, I don't like to do too much to my eyes. Because I want the face to be the attention, not the eyes. So, I'm going to go in with my Morphe eyeliner. It is in the shade Trendsetter. And I'm going to place that in my lash line. And I'm going to smoke it out. So, basically, I don't want it to be a thick line or a thin, thin line. I want it to be right in between. So, I'm going to place it onto here. It doesn't have to be straight whatsoever. Just make a line. I love this color. It's like the perfect brown. It took me forever to find a brown. And when I found it, I was like, mine. Okay, so I'm going to take a flat brush. This is a Morphe E43 brush. And I'm just going to smoke that out. So as you can tell, I created this little tiny wing. I don't want to do a whole entire wing. And I just basically winged it out with my brush okay so i'm just gonna smoke out the bronzer on my lash line and we're gonna be complete with the eyes i'm telling you this is like so fast so easy it takes like 10 minutes and you're out the house and this is a finished eye look um now i'm just gonna pop on some eyelashes i usually do mascara or eyelashes it just depends on my mood or how much time i have but for today, I'm going to do some eyelashes. I am doing the Beauty Creations eyelashes in Daydream. I have not tried these, but I heard so many good things about it. So I'm going to show you my favorite mascara. I love this mascara. It's so good. And this is a Lash Stiletto Maybelline Mascara. And 
I'm usually not like I don't really care for mascara but this mascara will make your eyelashes look nice can we just look at these eyelashes oh my god okay these eyelashes are so nice oh my god enjoy like 20 minutes of me talking about my eyelashes jesus christ i love these eyelashes my nose oh my god i almost forgot my nose <gasps> no way okay so i'm gonna take my brush that i used to put my bronzer on and i saw this trick on tiktok and i can't be the only one that's obsessed with tiktok so i saw this on tiktok and i tried it out the other day and it snatched my nose so good and so basically you grab it you grab some with your bronzer brush and you place it on your nose and it looks kind of crazy at the beginning i'm gonna have to do a video of like all these like tiktok tips and tricks that i've seen because they have helped me so just like that and it looks kind of crazy now i'm gonna take my beauty blender and i'm gonna dip some onto my powder and carve out the sides of the nose so the thinner you go the more your nose look i'm just gonna wait a couple of seconds and i will dust it off while i'm waiting for my nose to be done i'm gonna do my lips i also saw this trick on tiktok oh my god so you take some bronzer you place it on your cupid's bow and then it makes your lips look a little bit more fuller and lumped so for lips i'm gonna go in with my lip liner this is a morphe sweet tea lip liner and i'm just gonna fill in all my entire lips and even the insides of the lips so i start out in the middle and then i bring it out and then for my top lip my oh, my upper lip i am gonna start out in the top and work myself down so i usually do it like out but i'm bringing it in makes the lips look a little bit more fuller and doll like which i really like that look so this is the final look you guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video definitely try this look out and let me know what you guys think of it also comment down below what you guys want to see next thank you for watching i hope you guys enjoyed see you next time bye